triple letter score. 16 year old Emma Geiger has passed a lot of time in hospital waiting rooms. For years, doctors called her back time and again, trying to figure out why she got sick nearly every time she ate. It got so bad, Emma was forced to leave high school and take classes online. I mean, every day I'd call my dad up at work and Oh, I only threw up seven times a day, and that was like an accomplishment. Then Emma came to Nationwide Children's Hospital in Columbus, Ohio, where doctors told her the answer to her stomach problems might just be this. It's a pacemaker surgically implanted under the skin with electrical wires leading to her stomach. It's a high-tech device with one simple function. And what it does is it tells the stomach that it needs to empty. And it does that at a certain frequency that we set enough to get to get the stomach to empty, to get rid of the symptoms. For more than a million people like Emma, eating is a challenge. Most of us process the food we eat in a matter of minutes. In patients like Emma, it sits in the stomach for hours, making her bloated and nauseous and miserable. You may not realize it, but small electrical currents tell your stomach when to empty. But for some kids, this device has to do it for them. Only a handful have gotten the pacemaker so far, but early results are promising. Very satisfactory, very good results. Uh, symptoms improve remarkably within uh, two weeks. Okay, that works. It's working for Emma, who for the first time in four years will spend more time this fall in the classroom and less in a hospital room. At Nationwide Children's Hospital, this is Clark Powell reporting.